time our own Dina Kupfer was up all night basically on standby to evacuate her home in Vacaville. And here's her first hand account. As the ash still falls from the sky here in Vacaville, it has now been several hours since we were first told that we needed to pack our belongings and be prepared to evacuate at a moment's notice, something I will never forget. This fire progressed so quickly. Last night around 8.30 to 9 o'clock, we started to see ash falling in Vacaville. The air quality was bad, but in just a matter of hours, this fire had moved from Lake Berryessa to the top of Mount Vaca, then started to make its way down toward Pleasants Valley Road. Once it started to cross that road, 128, I knew we were in trouble. I started grabbing as many things as I could around the house, the passports, the paperwork, credit cards, things that you think you are going to need if you're going to be away from your home and might not have access to it again. Then I started staring at the walls, wondering what photos I wanted, wondering what were the most important items and things that I could leave behind, things that could be replaced. My husband and I did one round first and put as much in the car as we could photos, really important documents. And I said, I want to pack my wedding dress. And he said, you don't need that. Well, we ended up having enough time. So I went back in the house and I grind. If our house was brought down to its studs, I didn't want every happy memory that I ever had to go down with it. I wanted to save and hold on to something joyful. So I put that wedding dress in my Jeep and I was prepared to go. We waited. CHP made rounds. Vacaville police made rounds. A lot of our neighbors did decide to leave, but they were voluntary evacuations and we were monitoring the situation. We decided to stay behind and fortunately, our outcome is a positive one. We still have our home. We still have our health. We still have our dogs, but I have a whole new perspective on what going through a wildfire is like a very, very scary night. And I know for so many of my fellow Vacavillians, this is not the ending that they had. And my heart is with them today.